how the human beings on your planet are merely a resource waiting to be converted into capital. What Monroe said is that there were these entities that were feeding off human low vibrational emotion and mental energy, and he gave that the name Loosh. Get the primes here, attract them. If it's a counterfeit version, if it's a facsimile version, they'll never know the difference. I'll make it beautiful and good at the beginning so that they think they're in the right one. One thing that I really agree with, with, with the uh, Buddhism, is that your best chance of getting out of here and out of the simulation and out of the astral and out into infinity is immediately after death. Mm. Because if you fall for the tunnel trap, then you're in the cycle, you're in the wheel. Is they are allowed the higher dimensional consciousnesses and uh, the non-terrestrials that have ascended or they are in a light form or whatever, they are allowed to give us guidance they can break through the whole texture of this stuff and drop in the awareness into your mind, but they cannot pop in and say, hey, that's it, we're dismantling this stuff. Two clouds that are in the Moon-Earth system. These plasma clouds are filled with highly charged nano and micro particles. Those clouds alone could quite easily store every single thought, emotion, action, plant, person, animal ever to exist on Earth. Er is nergens een straffende God. Er zijn beschermende wetten om jou te loodsen terug naar thuis waar je komt. Je komt uit het licht. Altijd. Altijd.